I'm going to help you identify these Google cars when playing GeoGuessr and Battle Royale so you can get it right every time. Hi everyone, I'm Stevie J and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to run through different Google cars, so car meta with you on GeoGuessr and Battle Royale and hopefully help you to identify and get the right country every single time. So my first tip, and we're going to start with what I think is the most recognizable Google car, and that is the Kenyan car. You'll see at the front here, it has the little camera sticking up. Uh, sometimes it will have one on the other side, but you're only going to see that in Kenya. So that's very unique. So the next car is that of Uganda. You'll see here, has no panels on the side, but it has the sticky out wind mirrors and obviously you can see we're in Africa and then in Uganda they'll also drive on the left as well so quite easy to spot so another African country and this one you'll see has the side panels also has the wing mirrors sticking out but has the side panels here and this is unique only of Ghana and that's that they have the black tape on the front so you see this one here is clear and this one here, they have the black tape on the front. So if you see that, then you know you're only in Ghana. Our next tip, and probably a little bit more rare this one, um, this is an island next to Madagascar called Reunion. And unlike the Ghana one, doesn't have the tape on the front, but you'll see over here, on this side, it has the tape at the back. So I believe that's the only country that has their tape at the back. This one is very rare, but you'll see here on this map that actually it's a very small island and doesn't actually have many roads that are on Google Maps, so probably won't pop up that often, if at all. So our next four are all very recognizable as well. They all have the panels on the side of the car. The only difference for these four is that the panels and the cars are all the same. So you're going to have to do a little bit of detective work to figure out the difference between the, the few of them. So this one is Senegal. So you can see it looks like Africa, but with Senegal, you've got these rifts in the sky. So it should help you easily distinguish between this one and the other ones. And also, Senegal drive on the right. And the second one of those four is Guatemala. So you see again has the panels at the side but you can see very different landscape has that American South American feel to it so you should be able to easily spot this one and of course they speak Spanish in Guatemala. Our third one is going to be Kyrgyzstan so again has the side panels but Kyrgyzstan, for me, looks and feels a lot like Russia. It quite often can be gloomy. So you see very gloomy surroundings. So you should be able to recognize that over the others. So the fourth one of those four is going to be Laos. Again, has the little side panels. But you can see it looks like Asia. The landscape is very Asian. Mongolia also has the side panels except this time they're a little bit different you can see they've got this black strip in the middle of the bars not only that but they have this pack on the top which you'll only see in Mongolia and again should be able to notice what the Mongolian landscape feels like very desolate. So another country that has these bars, the same as Mongolia, with the black stripe, is Dominican Republic. Again, a very small island, very rare, won't come up very often, but it's good for you to know that this is an option. And again, you can see has that American landscape that should be very recognizable and help you distinguish between this and some of the other ones with sidebars. Bangladesh also has sidebars, as you can see here, except the difference with Bangladesh is 
They'll also have the red mirrors at the front. So this is unique of Bangladesh. So if you see the red mirrors, then you know you can only be in Bangladesh. Um, just remember though, some cars in Bangladesh don't have this and they won't have the side panels. They'll just be normal cars. So bear that in mind. So this next one is very rare and there won't be a lot of people that know about this. And that is this South African car. So you'll see here, has the side panels and what's different is it has the little camo at the sides by the wing mirrors and you'll see this only in a small area and that is Kruger National Park so you'll see here this little small Af area in Africa is the only place you'll see this car so you'll almost be able to pinpoint exactly where you are if you get this car so something else you want to pay careful attention to and that is cars like this in Japan so the Japanese car not only has a big blur across the whole road for their car but also they're going to be very low to the ground so you'll notice this car compared to a lot of the other cars is very low the camera's down low so if you see that then you know you're going to be in Japan and it also has if you're not sure these little stripes here on their lampposts so there's a few little tips that can give that away if you're not quite sure and again you can see this car is the same but this car you'll find in Switzerland so I believe this is the only European car that is low to the ground like this so this will help you spot Switzerland if you're not sure if you've seen all these mountains and you're not sure if you're in Austria or Switzerland then that will help you tell the difference and then in Sri Lanka you can spot the Google car by the pattern at the front of the car here this one's quite faint but it has like a blue white and red fade or blur at the front of the car so you'll see that quite often in Sri Lanka okay so our next three clues or our next three countries are related to the front of the car a lot like Sri Lanka but these this time we have a black stripe on the bonnet or at the front of the car this is only in three places so that's Argentina Uruguay and Peru so if you're playing Battle Royale and you see that then you know you've got a one in three chance of getting it right straight away so this one is Argentina again you can see the same here for Uruguay and then the same here for Peru and Peru tends to be a little bit more mountainous a little bit more hilly so that should help you spot Peru over the other two there you go guys there are my tips to help you recognize all the Google cars and hopefully get some easy guesses next when you're playing Battle Royale so if you found that useful don't forget to subscribe and I can do some more videos like this and um, thanks for joining us I've been Stevie J and I'll see you guys in the next one Thank you.